All right, hey guys, welcome back to another. It's not a solo Sunday. Today's Tuesday, or it should be Tuesday when you see this. Another playthrough of Terraform Wars Ares Expedition. So today we're gonna be doing the Crisis mode. Like I said in the last video, we um, in the main game it's competitive. I think there is maybe a cooperative version, of two players, but basically it's competitive. Let's get Mars terraformed. And Crisis, Crisis is a version of the game that is. Um, uh, cooperative completely and you start with a fully terraformed planet and you are going to be thrown these different crises to try to keep the planet um, at full health as much as possible and if you can successfully get to the whole crisis without the planet being destroyed you win the game if you get to a certain point you lose the game pretty straightforward so just like the regular game we have our phase cards here we're going to do those um, I'll kind of give an overview quickly of like how the game is played. So every turn we'll put detriment tokens out based on the metrics. That those are these things here. We'll explain those as they come up. Um, resolve any persistent effects. We'll see those when they come up as well. We'll draw a card from the crisis deck and resolve any immediate effects. And then we'll draw a hand from the dummy cards. Now that and then we have our planning steps, our uh, phase steps, and then the end steps. Like you can spend two victory points to move a crisis counter of any number of times. So again, we'll kind of explain some of that stuff. That's all right here. Basically, in solo, we get to draw two of these, and what they are, they're double. They have two phases on them, and we're gonna choose which two phases to do, and we'll do those as well as our our phases. So we get to kind of choose it all. Um, I haven't chosen my corporation yet. The other thing you're gonna notice is that I have the cards are in orange. Um, so let's go ahead and actually get our eight. The cards are in orange. Um, so with the Kickstarter, you could have gotten the uh, another set of cards. They actually have different backs. They have backs for Crisis um, versus like the normal one. There's the normal one and there's the Crisis one. So there, they, there are certain cards that can't, that have to be removed. So like remove any of the cards you draw if they have any of this stuff or milestones and those cards. So. This basically does it to where you don't have to deal with that and remember, oh, I have to remove this and such and such. And then it creates a just, it just makes it easy because I have a different set of deck of cards that does, this is my crisis cards, this is my normal cards. And really this game to me, when you do this mode, feels like a different game entirely. So I actually kind of treat it differently. Um, but anyway, here's our hand. Let's go ahead and draw two of these. Oh, we already saw that one, so I don't want that one again. And there are some specific to crisis mode. Um, I think they say it in here. Some of these, there are a few of them that are specific to Crisis. Yeah, like use only during Crisis mode. Use only during Crisis mode. So, oh yeah, only use only during Crisis mode. So we have uh, Orbix United. Uh, you start with 30 mega credits. Use only when in Crisis mode. And it says actions. You and another player each gain two mega credits. If you're playing solo, gain three instead. Which, mind you, it's just free money, which is great. We have Launch Star Incorporated. Uh, at the start of the game, reveal the top card. Reveal from the deck until you reveal a blue card and place it into your hand. Discard the rest. You start with three mega credits. When you play a blue card, you play for three less. I think I'm going to go with um, um, Orbix United. So we're going to start with 38 money. And then every time, then we just get uh, three money. All right. This is our starting hand. Um, I think I don't want those two. We do have some microbes here. We might run some microbe stuff because there's just microbe, microbe. You get one. Okay. Okay. I think I'll get rid of all this stuff. Okay. So we're going to set these down here. We've got our phase cards here. We've got this. So first thing is put any put in any detriment tokens out. There are none. These tokens will come out when we get to certain metrics. So for if we get to the yellow, the red, so on and so forth. I believe the losing condition of the game is if the if if the dwindling crisis supply, which is only the four tier, comes out on the deck and three terraform metrics are during are are completed, you win. So there will be cards that come out that are different tiers so we start with tier one tier two tier three tier four tier five when we get to tier four once we have everything terraform back complete to completion we win the game 
I am playing on the easiest mode, which involves three tier zero cards, so we'll get over those. But we lose the game if the ocean, the oxygen, or the temperature is in the purple zone during the metric check at the beginning of the round. So if we get down to purple, for oceans, uh, seven through nine of these here are white, four through six are yellow, two through three, two and three are red, and then zero and one are blue or purple. It says if you are forced to decrease temperature or oxygen and the cube is on the last purple space, the players lose. The same is true if you flip an aisle, a ocean eye, eye, and you can't. And then if you were to draw a crisis card from the deck, but it's completely empty, and the terraform metric's not complete, the players lose. So, a lot of ways to lose, one way to win. All right, so let's get started here. We're gonna flip over the first card, which is Break Forecast. Uh, Thrasis or Tharsis City, please respond. Initial. Uh, predictions of ongoing effects of the an asteroid of the size are um, of an asteroid of this size are cat catastrophic spreading seismic events will evolve into destructive tsunamis and will impact the entire planet with temperatures dropping all standing water will begin to freeze scientists are unsure how long we can we have before the uh, onset of a verbatable ice age I don't know if we don't act quickly Mars will become nothing but a barren wasteland again and we'll be trapped on it discard this card so this is basically we're gonna get three free turns so we're gonna discard this card so that's gone all right so we're, we've done with the crisis step because there's nothing to do we're to do planning which is i guess figuring out what cards you want to play so we're gonna draw actually we're gonna draw from here so we get to choose which two we want i think i want research and i want production just so that we can kind of get a little bit of stuff going here and i think in the meantime we're going to do develop so we're going to run through these phases here so we'll do develop first. Um, let's go ahead and do um, economic growth. It's going to cost us 10 minus 3, so it's going to cost us 7. We'll get 3 mega credits for production. And then on production, we'll get 8. And we'll draw two cards and discard one. I think we'll keep that. Okay, so these get discarded. All right. We're gonna do it again. So we're gonna go to the next thing. This is a distress signal. So this is the same thing again. Thrasa City, please respond. A large asteroid touched down in the forest to the south. Oh, this is all out of order. <laughs> uh, asteroid's coming. I'm not gonna read it all. It's all out of order. It's all good. Okay. So again, we're going to flip over the next two cards here. I think uh, we want to probably get a card out, and we can do an action to get some money. And I think for us, let's go ahead and do, we'll do construction. We'll just get some stuff built. So we're going to play a green card here. I think what I want is this here. So it's going to cost us six. Increase our plant production by one. Then we're going to do construction. We'll play uh, that for six. It says uh, one victor point for three microbes on this card. And then it says um, action add one carb to this microbe or one microbe to this card. So what's going to happen is, is that instead of gaining victory points at the end of the game, we're going to be able to get these tokens. So once we get to the point of adding the microbes to the card, we'll create these tokens, set them up here. Then that's when we can use the spend to remove crisis counters or to play a card with negative points. That's how we can play those cards. So that's what the point of that is. But this will be good to help us kind of get some passive victory point ability uh, there. And then we can play another card. So let's play this for one, which is Invention Contest. Draw three cards, keep one of them, discard the other two. Um, do I have any more of the arrows? I don't. So we're gonna keep we're gonna keep power grid. And then finally we have uh, actions here. So we're gonna get three mega credits for our first thing, and then we're gonna add a microbe to this card. Yeah. So when we get to three microbes, we're gonna discard. We're gonna basically swap them out for a token and place a token up there. All right, so that's our second turnover. We're going to get rid of these. All right, and here's the last um, damage report. So this is the last tier zero. So we get to bypass anything, we'll shuffle up. All right, so now this is where, after this turn, this is where the real fun begins. 
All right, so we've got, um, I think what I wanna do is probably get develop out. I probably want a round of production. And we can take some action, we can do that, okay. So we're gonna play a green card. We'll play this for, uh, it'll cost us three, no two. Increase plants. We'll do our actions, so it'll give us three point, three money, as well as adding a microbe here. And then we'll produce, it's gonna be five, six, seven, eight money and two plants. Oops. All right. The uh, handcuffs are now gone. <laughs> All right, so let's get ready for the first one. So we've got uh, atmospheric rupture, lose five mega credits or one TR. We're gonna lose five mega credits. Then that's the immediate effect. Then it says play a space tag to remove this counter and it comes up with one counter. And then it's ongoing, it's persistent effect is decreasing the oxygen. So we're gonna play this. It's gonna get a counter here. And again, for us to remove it, we're gonna to have to play a card with a uh, space tag. So we're gonna play one of these to get rid of it. If we don't, it's gonna decrease the oxygen at the beginning of the turn. So we've, no detriment tokens are out. We're gonna resolve the persistent effects. There are no persistent effects. We're gonna draw a card from the Christ deck, which we've done. Now we're gonna do the dummy hand. Okay, I need to get a blue card out. We've got a space tag. So we're gonna run that one first. I think, let's get some more cards and then we'll run um, some production. So we'll do this stuff here. So we are going to start by playing a blue card for 15. We played a space tag, it removes this counter, which gets rid of this, so this is gone. And then this is gain a mega credit if you played uh, upgrade phase this turn, gain two more mega credits. So this just gives us two, but if we played an upgrade card this turn, upgrade phase card, we get two more. Um, that gave us our space tag. We're gonna do production this round, so there's five, six, seven, eight again. We're gonna get two of these. And now we're gonna draw five cards and discard, uh, to, uh, discard or keep two of them. Um, and when we play cards with these uh, with points on them, they do count for our points over there. So we do wanna keep in mind for those cards. I think this gives us heat, which we're gonna want. So this says, when you play an earth tag, including this one, add a microbe to this card up to five. Effect is when you draw cards on the research phase, draw an additional card for each microbe on this card. You just draw a lot of cards. This may be good. I kind of like this uh, tectonic stress power. It gives us three heat production, but I kind of like this. I kind of like this, so we're gonna go with that. Okay. All right, so that ends. We're gonna do any detriment tokens. There are none, no persistent effects. We're gonna draw a card from the crisis deck. Um, draw a card, decrease the temperature by one. So the temperature is gonna go down by one. We're gonna draw a card. Then uh, it's persistent ability will decrease the temperature by one every time. But play a building tag to remove a counter and it only comes out with one counter. We're gonna draw that one and flip over. And I have some stuff I think I can play. So I think we're good um, for this round as well. But we wanna, I'm gonna to try to increase the temperature right now, if possible. So here's develop. I think we're gonna do this. So the thing is, the other thing too, is that in the main game, if you were, if multiple people were to play the same phase card, you don't get to do something more than once. Where, where like, so if the dummy player and myself played green, we would only get to do one green card. But here, I could play green. We could do it twice, but I only get the benefit one time, the extra benefit one time. At least that's the way that I read the rules. So that's also, that's a possibility, but I don't think, I don't know that that's what I wanna do. 
So this will get us five money for our blue cards, and then um, we'll get a micro, which gives us a victory point. Um, and then I can use some stuff to, I have to pen 14 increase the temperature back up. I'm going to get this to play a green. So maybe I do do production. Okay. So we're going to go green first. Well, this is actually, well, we're going to play this one. This is going to cost us 15 to play. Do I have the money? Wait a minute. I need to see if I have the money for keep increasing the temperature. I've got 10 there, 11. We're gonna wait on this one. We're gonna do this one instead. It's gonna cost us eight. Increase our, uh, by two. We played a uh, building tag, so that card's gone. And then, um, so we played that. We're gonna do our action, so it's gonna give us two money. It's gonna give us uh, two more money. This is three money, technically. So it's five money, and we get a microbe on here, which is going to get us a victory point token. And then we're going to produce, which is going to be five. Oh, hold on. We got standard actions. And, yeah, standard actions. So I'm going to spend the one, two. That's 10, 14 to increase this, which is going to increase our terraforming rating. Now we're going to do production. So it's going to give us six plus nine, or six plus three is nine, and then two here and two here. Okay. Crisis is being managed right now. All right. Things are going good so far. It's not to say that they're going to continue to go that well, but we'll see. All right. So no detriment tokens to place, no persistent effects. We're going to do the next card here. Um, we have, we're going to lower the ox, or we're going to decrease this. I'm going to de remove this tile. So it's just going to flip that. Let's just flip that over. So randomly reveal a phase card from your hand. You can't play it this round. That's its immediate effect. Play a green card to remove this counter. And then it comes out with two crisis tokens. So see, this is where things get difficult because now we're going to have to deal with more than one thing. So we're going to have to play a green card to remove it. Okay. So there's two crisis counters there. And this can't be played this turn. Great. <laughs> can't play a green card. I need to remove a green card. So I'm going to flip this over. Get no read cards from that. So that's going to be kind of a bummer here. Um, I think what we're going to do, I'm going to do actions. No, I'm going to do production, action, and research. Get us a couple more options here. So for action, we're going to gain our microbe. We're going to get our five money. We're going to produce. We're going to get six. It's going to be nine again. Two heat. Uh, this is the persistent effect, so it didn't happen yet. Two heat, uh, two plants. And then we're going to draw one, two, three, four, five. Green cards galore. I want this one. I don't want to lose any. Well, okay, we'll take these two. All right, so this and this go. This goes, we get this back. Okie dokie, so now we're gonna resolve the persistent effect, which is gonna uh, lower the ocean. Um, we don't have to do anything for the detriment tokens. We'll do our next crisis card. So now we've got two things to deal with. Lose two mega credits and decrease the temperature by one. Oh my goodness. And then it's um, persistent effect is also to decrease the oceans. And then it says, um, the. Uh, Increase the auction or discard four plants during the uh, action phase to remove a counter, and it has one counter, and it's our first tier two card. So we're going to lose two money. We're going to decrease the temperature by one, and I have to increase the oxygen to get rid of it or, or spend four. On the action phase, we have to play blue. So I need to play blue this turn and green. Okay. So we have this here. I guess we'll do. I guess we'll do this. Okay. So we'll play our green card here. The green card that I want to play will be this one. So we're going to spend uh, 15 to play it. It's we've remove a counter. 
then we um, increase this by five. And we have to spend two. Did I already spend these two? I don't think I did. Okay. Then the action phase happens. We're going to get five money. We're going to add a microbe. And then we're going to spend four plants to get rid of this token. So this one's gone. Can I increase the temperature back up? 14? Yeah, we're going to do that. We're going to increase the temperature. Increase our terraformer rating. And then we're going to do... Um, Production, so it's going to be 7 plus uh, 3 is 10. We have 8 heat and 2 plants. All right. So this is going to lower one of these. We are going to flip over the next crisis card. Um, so its persistent effect is lower the oxygen. It says either discard a green card from your tableau, adjusting your production accordingly, or flip an ocean face down. And it says flip an ocean tile face up or discard three cards in your hand to remove this crisis. Don't want to get rid of something in my tableau. Yes, I will get rid of this card. Get rid of this. It'll lower our uh, plant production. And then... We have to flip an ocean tile to, to um, fix it, which we should be able to. I'm going to try to on my next turn. Okay. So there's those two crisis cards there. We need to play a green card to get rid of this one. And we need to do an action phase to do the um, to do this ability to flip the card over. So we're going to, this is what we're playing. So first off, green card. Let's play... This card here, Power Cell, is going to cost us five. Um, and then we're going to get uh, money per one, uh, the lightning symbol there. So we have three, one, two, three. That gets rid of this. We're going to do our action phase, which is going to be five money back. Another microbe, which is going to give us three. It's going to give us another victory point token. So we can actually use this to remove that at the end of the round. But I want to increase this back up just to not put us in a bad spot. So we're going to spend 15 to flip one of these. We're going to get to draw a card and increase our terraforming rating, removing this token as well. And then we're going to do production, which is going to be 8 plus 6 is 14. 8 heat. And one plant. All right, crisis is being managed. Okay, for our next card here, uh, decrease a, discard a card from your hand. Uh, we'll, that'll be plenty fine. We're gonna discard. We'll discard this, and then it says increase the temperature or lose six heat during the action phase to remove a counter. Heat's all the way at the top, and then its persistent ability is to decrease the oxygen. So the, the heat is already to the top, so we may just spend the heat. To, we have plenty of heat, so we may just do that. But it forces us to play an uh, action card, which at least the action card is passively getting us money and passively getting us um, microbes. So we're, it's not totally bad. I've got a decent engine here going. So I think what I want to do is I'm going to do this, this, and I want to play construction here. So I think right off the bat, we're going to go ahead and play um, this card out for five. Draw two cards. We can draw another card. Then we're going to do um, action ability. It's going to get us five money. We're going to add a microbe. I'm going to spend six uh, heat to remove the, t the token. And then I'm going to spend my 15 money to flip this back over, increasing this, draw a card. And then we're going to do research, draw two, and discard one. Okay, so we're going to do some producing next round. Okay, I got a lot of cards here. So there's a lot, of, a lot of stuff to deal with. Okay, 
So no detriment token, no persistent effect. So we're going to go to the next one here. Um, randomly reveal a face card from your hand. You cannot uh, choose that face card this round. Decrease the auction by one step. So, and then play a blue counter, blue card to remove this counter. And then you have to have two counters and it's persistent effect as decrease the temperature. Okay. So we're going to shuffle, shuffle, shuffle. We can't play that this turn, which is what I wanted. Two counters and I don't have, I can't, oh man. And then we're going to decrease the oxygen by one. Okay. So flip these over. So I at least get production here, but I'm kind of in a spot because I can't really, I can't really play anything. So this is what we're going to do. We're going to discard this and discard this to get six money. And I'm actually going to discard this to get another three money. We're getting this dang blue card played. We're gonna do this, we're gonna do this. Mm. And we're gonna do this. So first off, we'll, we'll play a blue card for seven. So again, and then we get a victory point token. Okay, this is great, because this ends up doing it where we can spend it to get rid of the other opponent. When you play an earth card, including this one, add a microbe. And then when you draw cards on the research phase, draw an additional card for each microbe. Okay. Then we're going to do actions. We're going to get five money for this and this. We'll add a microbe here. We're going to do production. Oh, I played a blue card, so one token's gone. We're going to do production. It's going to put us at nine. Nine. Fifteen. We're going to get a plant. We're going to get eight heat. And unfortunately, I can't raise... I could... I could spend money to raise the, yeah, we're going to spend money. We're going to spend 20 to raise the oxygen back up. It's going to increase this to 10. And instead of getting a victory point token, we get, or instead of getting a, uh, one of the forest tokens, we get a victory point token. Okay. So then at the, uh, we're going to resolve all that stuff. So that's taken care of. We'll get these cards back. Now we're going to spend two of our victory point tokens to remove this counter. And then that card is now gone. Okay, things are, are manageable. They're manageable. All right, no persistent effects, no detriment tokens. We are keeping everything great. All right, so draw a card. Then it says play an Earth or Jovian tag to remove this. And then it'll decrease the temperature. Do I have? I have neither of those. Oh, that stays here, sorry. Okay, that's coming out. We may need a draw, but I won't be able to do anything about it until after. So we may just have to deal with eat. We may have to eat that. But that's okay. Yeah, I've got no Jovian or Earth tags. We could do this. I think this is what we I want to do. I want to do this. Nope, I don't. Cuz I have no money. No money. So I think we're going to do this. We're going to do this. We're going to do this. And then we're going to do this. And before I do before we go any farther, I'm going to discard this card and this card for money. We're gonna play this for seven. We'll get to draw a card. Then, oh, there we go. Then we're gonna do production. So it's gonna be 10, 16. We're going to get eight heat again. So we have like mad heat coming out. And then one plant. We're going to do research. And now this time we have to draw six cards because we have that many. We have a microbe. We get to keep two. Ooh. Okay. 
I like this. I like this. Okay. I need some diversity in my cards in my hand too, so I just have to make green cards just in case stuff comes up. So we've completed all that. We'll finish resolving these. And I'm going to go ahead and spend these two point tokens. No, I'm going to leave it because I have so much in terms of I have so much in terms of uh heat that we can we can maintain keeping the heat up. Okay. All right, so persistent ability is going to go through. We're going to decrease the heat. We'll play another card here. Its persistent ability is two ocean tiles. Decrease the temperature and oxygen each by one. Flip an ocean. Oh, gosh. And then we need to place an, uh, one of these counters, one of the event counters, event tags to remove a counter. And I have none of those. So this is where the, oh, these are wrong. These two should be here. Okay. So down and flip over. Okay. I'm gonna take these two here. What do we got? I'm gonna play this earth tag card so I, I know that this has to be the card I play. Now, Now the the thing is going to be if we do this we're going to get another t we'll get another thing here which will help us get rid of one of the things on there. So I think this is how we're going to do it. We're going to do this. So I'm going to start off by playing Olympus Conference. It's going to be 15. We've played the earth tag so this gets removed. And then it says whenever you play a card with this tag, including this one, draw a card. So we get to draw a card. Then, oh, and I played another earth tag, so I get to add another microbe to this. We'll do our action phases. We'll get our five money for our corporation in this card. We'll also get to add a microbe here, which will turn into a victory point token. Oh, I get a victory point token for that as well. I didn't keep track of that. And then we'll draw three cards, four cards, and keep one. Because again, we've got two of the microbes here, which increase that by two. I think I'm going to take that. And then I'm going to spend all, oh, hold on. We Let me, before I, I guess, before I finish my drawing, we're going to do, and we're going to increase some stuff. So we're going to increase the temperature back. So one, two, three, that's 15, 16. This goes back all the way up to the top, which increases this by two. Okay. Need to do that first. And then we did our card draws. And then I'm going to spend all four of these. So that's to remove both of these crisis counters. Okay. Things are going okay. So no detriment token and no uh, uh, persistent effect. Decrease temperature by two. I just increased it. Then uh, play a uh, Jovian or Earth counter to remove this card. And then its persistent effect is an ocean and the oxygen. All right. So we're going to have that card. We're going to shuffle. I don't have any more. I have this card, but it's so expensive. So we're going to need to do some production, and we're going to need to fix... We're going to need to fix the... Uh, the temperature again. So I think with this, we're most definitely going to run this here. I think we're going to do this. And then I guess this. I'm going to discard down these two. Give me six money. OK. So let's do everything. So playing a blue card here. Mm. I'm gonna play this for eight, but I won't have enough to increase the, the oxygen. Maybe I do this, play this for 12. So it's gonna get us a victory point token. And then when we do actions, we can spend one mega credit to get two plants. 
So now we're going to do our action phase. It's going to give us five money there, a microbe here, and then we're going to be able to spend a money to get two plants. And then our standard actions, we're going to increase the uh, oxygen back up by one, increasing our terraforming rating. It's going to get us another victor point token. Ah, we can use both those to remove that. Then we're going to do the temperature back. That's eight. Increase this, increasing that. Then we're going to do our production, which is going to be 14, 18, um, plus six is 24. We need to get some more plants out. I'm going to make some, I'm going to consolidate some things there. Okay. All right. And then the end of the round, we'll spend these two and remove this token. This is gone. Oh, this has got me stressed out. All right. We've got collapsing cities. Uh, draw and resolve one, uh, only one phase card from the dummy this turn and then decrease temperature by two. Come on. Now the temperature's in the yellow. So if we don't mitigate this, this is play a green card to get rid of this. So if we don't get, we don't deal with the temperature increasing, we don't increase it back up, we are going to put a detriment token out and it's just going to make things, it's going to start snowballing down. But it only requires one, uh, one thing to go. So we're only going to play one dummy card. We need a green card to play for that. So that's going to be fine. And then we have to do action phase to increase the temperature back up. So that's what we're going to do. We are going to spend 13 for this, which is going to give us a victory point token. And then we get one production, one mega credit production for each of these symbols. And we've got one, two, three, four, five, six symbol. Holy cow. That's going to put us up to 12. Uh, there, yeah, that, now it's a, there we go. I didn't take it off from the last game. Oh, and we get, we get up for this. We get another one because of that, because of this card. Holy cow. Okay, great. That's awesome. That's a lot of money. Then we're going to do our action phase. So it's another five money microbe here. Spend the money for two plants. And then we're going to, because we chose it, I'm actually going to spend another money for two plants. And then we're going to spend um, eight heat to increase the temperature. Um, yeah, I think that's good. And we played a green card, so that's gone. All right. We have no uh, detriment tokens, no persistent effects. All right, draw a card, decrease the oxygen by two. Drew that. Then um, play a plant tag, remove the counter, and it only needs one. Okay, so we're almost to the end because the we need the four. We need to kind of keep these in line. And then when the four tier, the tier four comes up, that's what we have to make sure. After that point, if we have we're fully terraformed, we win. Okay, so these two will be played. Plant tag. I have no plant tags. What the hey? But that's okay. Because we're going to start doing some stuff. So I'm going to produce. I think what I want to do is this. So I think this is what we're going to do. So we'll develop. We'll play this. It's going to cost me 10. Because I played a green card. We're also going to increase our money production by 1. This is increase our heat production by 3. Actually, that's not even what I wanted to play. That's not the card I wanted to play. So let me go back. I want to play this one. This will cost us 16. That's what I meant to do. Increase our money production by one. Increase our plant production by two. Is that all I can do here with that? Yeah. Then we're going to do our actions. We're going to get five money. We're going to add our microbe, which is going to give us a victory point counter, which we can use to get rid of that. Um, we're going to pay this to get two plants. Do I have eight plants? Sure do. We're going to spend our eight plants. 
to increase the oxygen up. We're gonna get up there and it's gonna get us another victory point counter. And then we're gonna do production, which is now 16 um, plus 14, which is 30. Man, I got a lot of money. Eight heat. Three plants. Uh, we should be in good shape. We should be in good shape. I'm going to spend two of these to get rid of this token. So this game really just really worked out for me in terms of getting the um, getting stuff with victory points to play um, to get those tokens up to manage everything. Those have been really like I just a sufficient engine to manage um, the I manage the the acquisition of the victory point bank. Okay. Second impact, so decrease the oxygen and temperature by two, flip two ocean tiles, discard this, holy moly. So this goes one, two, one, two, one, two, and one, two. So right now, if we don't deal with this, we're gonna get detriment tokens out for everything, and that is gonna be a problem. So we need to flip over one, two, three, four, five. We need to flip over one of these to put it back in the white. We need to go two temperature and one oxygen to get all everything back in white. So let's see what we've got here. We've got money to do stuff. We're going to need this to do stuff. So I think what we're going to do is this, this. And I think for me, let's construct... So we're going to spend eight to get out uh, progressive policies. This is going to give us another one of these tags, which means we get to draw a card. I didn't actually do this the last time, but I should have drawn a, drawn a card for when that. Our money will increase by one. Then uh, whenever we do the action phase, we can, spend 10, we can spend 10 mega credits to increase the oxygen. But if we have four of these uh, tags, we get to decrease it by five. We have one... Two, three. We only have three of the tags. We're not going to be able to do it yet. We're going to draw a card for our second ability. Then we're going to do our action phase, which is going to be five money. Microbe. Spend one of these for two plants. And spend ten money to increase the oxygen. We're then going to spend... We have eight heat here. To increase this by one. That increases this. I'm going to spend 15 to flip over an oxygen. Or not an oxygen, an ocean. Which is going to get us a card draw and a money. Um, our temperature is still kind of down, so I think we're going to have to wait on that one, unfortunately. And then we're going to do research. It's going to be drawing three, four cards because of our card here and keeping only one. I'm gonna keep that one. Okay, so now we're gonna see what the, the detriment token is. So because we're in yellow, we have a temperature detriment token that's gonna be played. This is, you must, uh, your cards cost one mega credit more to play. So this is now in effect because our temperature is in yellow. Once the temperature goes to red, it'll flip and become, it costs three more to play. So detriment tokens out. Now we're gonna we have no persistent effect. We have no uh, we're gonna flip over this. So this is now decrease the temperature and oxygen each one step. Flip an ocean tile face down. Set this card aside. For the rest of the game, you may spend one victory point token to gain five mega credits. Fully terraform Mars before the deck runs out. So one one. Then it is um, flip an ocean tile. Okay, now we're going to have to terraform the plant to win the game before this deck runs out. I have no money. And we can spend the VP points to spend one to gain five megahertz. We're going to spend the one to get five megahertz. I don't think the rest of the cards have uh, crisis counters, so I think that's kind of where we are with this. I believe once we, I gotta double check, but I believe once we uh, exceed the detriment token um, requirement, 
we can remove it. At the start of the turn, check the current state of the temperature of the oxygen. If any of the metrics are in yellow or red, take the matching detriment token, flip the coordinates by the side, and set aside in the middle of the table. Yeah, I assume that. Okay. Okay, so this is where we try to figure out what we're going to do here. I think we're going to do this. There's not a lot of actions I can do. So I think what we're going to do is probably, I'm going to discard a bunch of stuff to get some money. Um, I want to keep um, one, two, three, four, five. So we're going to get 15 money. And we've got to increase, increase some stuff pretty badly because otherwise we're kind of in a bad spot there. Okay. So we're going to do this. We're going to do this. And then we're going to do this. So first we're going to play a green card. We're going to play this for 11. Um, it's going to increase our uh, money production by two. And then we're going to gain three plants. We're then going to do action. So it's going to give us five money. We're going to get a uh, thing there. We can spend a money for a plant, but I'm not going to do that. We can spend 10 money for this, which is going to increase that. This will go up. We'll get a victory point token. Then we're going to spend, um, or maybe we don't get a victory point token for that. We might not get a victory point token for that. So I'm going to take that back. Which, if I did it earlier, I apologize. We are going to get one for this, though. So I'm going to spend the eight to increase this back up. So if we got one earlier and it changed the outcome slightly, then it's my bad. And then I feel like... Oh, I don't know. I might have just... this. I don't know. So then we're going to do our production, which is going to be 20, 30, 37... Eight and three. Maybe I should have spent more money to get some more plants for my. No, I can't do that. Never mind. Okay. Okay. Oh, it's actually going to cost me one more to play. I forgot that for that detriment. So that actually costs one more to play. So there's that. This is gone. These are gone. All right. So now I'm going to. I will spend this for five money, I suppose. So now we have to assess this. So we're still at the temperature deficit, but we're all at the ocean one too. So this will be decrease either the oxygen or uh, temperature by one. So we're going to decrease the oxygen by one. We're going to play the next card here. Uh, decrease. Oh my gosh. Decrease the temperature by two. Decrease the oxygen by one. Flip an ocean tile. Discard this. Decrease the temperature by two the oxygen by one and the oceans by one okay as you can see this is getting out of hand all right i'm gonna flip that over maybe i shouldn't have discarded all those cards okay so this is happening this is happening for sure and this is happening so first and foremost we're going to get our five money we're going to get our microbe, which is going to get us a victory point token, which I'm going to spend for five money. We are going to spend a money for two plants. And I'm going to spend 10 money to increase the oxygen. Increase this. We have three here, or eight here, to increase this. That goes up. We have... Oh... Man, this is kind of rough. I'm going to discard this for three money. So I think now it's going to cost me. I, I'm going to try to get the oxygen up. 
or not the oxygen, the, the temperature. So it's going to cost me 28. So there's 20, 25, 28. This will go up by 2, 1, 2. Oh, I need to do it again. Here's another 14. One more. 1, 2, 3. And then the oceans cost 15, and I don't have enough money for that. So at least those are in the white. We're going to do production. Production is going to be 25, 35, 42. We're going to get this. And we're going to get this. Okay. There's that. I think this goes away. Or they just sits, maybe just sits out. Yeah, because you check you check the status of it, and if the status is there, then it persists. So if it's not there, it doesn't matter. Okay, so these are gone. This is out. We're going to do this. Um, we're going to check the detriment tokens. The temperature is now in the white, so that's gone. We still have to deal with – I mean, this is still – I mean, oh, I guess we still do this. So it happens. We have to decrease again. I think that's maybe that's how that works. Dang it. Okay. Uh, decrease the temperature by two, the oxygen by one, flip two ocean tiles. Oh my goodness. Decrease the temperature by two, the oxygen by one, and flip two ocean tiles. Come on. Yeah, I don't think this is happening. So that's out. So I think we just do it for that round and then, okay. So two crisis cards. Oh, I didn't draw up my, I have to draw my five my six, seven cards and then discard. Um, does any of this stuff give me anything? That'll be helpful. Oh, this, I need that. And that may come in handy. Yeah, okay. And I'm gonna discard that for three money. Okay, there we go. I forgot to do that entirely. So we need to produce, we need actions, and we need this. So I'm going to play, I'm going to spend 12 to get this out. Ironworks is going to let me spend 4 to increase the temperature. Oh, I'm gonna, sorry, spend 4 heat to decrease the oxygen. Um, then we're going to draw a card. This may come in handy as well. We're going to do actions. So we're going to get our 5 money. We're going to add the microbe. We are going to spend 10 to increase the oxygen. Increase that. We're going to spend 4 heat to increase the oxygen. We're going to spend this to increase the temperature. Spend these to increase the oceans, which is going to be 2 plants. And for money, I think I did, let's see, there's eight, increase this, get us a victory point token, increase, change that for five. Um, Jeez, this ramped up pretty badly. <laughs> uh, I need 15. Spend 15 here for another ocean tile. Increase that. We'll get a card draw and we'll get uh, a plant. Okay, and then we're gonna do production, which is just gonna be 32, um, 42, 42, 51. We have three of these. And we have one silver and three of those. Okay. I don't know how this, I don't know how we're gonna make this work. All right, that is the end of that. 
We are going to look at the detriment tokens. We are now, we have one, two, three, four, five, six. So it's gonna be ocean one, which is gonna decrease. And then we have the temperature one, which is gonna make everything cost more. All right, last crisis card. Decrease the oxygen by two, the temperature by one, and flip an ocean tile face down. So decrease the oxygen by two, temperature by one, and, and flip over an ocean tile. Okay, so we have this turn to win the game. Which I don't know how it's going to happen, if I'm being completely honest with you. <laughs> I just don't know. Because playing something like this is going to be so costly that there's no kind of... There's no getting around it. So I think what we're going to do is do this, do this. I guess do this. So this is going to cost us, uh, I'm going to spend three, discard that to get three money. This is going to cost us 11 to play. It's going to cost 11 to play. No, oh, I don't know why I just did. Oh yeah, three money for that and then 11. We're going to get a victory point token that we're going to swap out for... That so I, I guess I should have saved those tokens for later because it would have given me a bunch of money. I didn't know that, so now we do. Actually, it's going to cost me one extra because of this. Then we're going to increase our plant production and gain a plant. We are then going to go to the action phase. We're going to get a, a thing here. We're going to get a five here. I'm going to spend this for two plants. We're going to spend four here for this increase this spend 10 to increase it spend 8 to increase this we'll get a victory point token we'll swap out for this um my temperature is just out of whack. We're gonna spend that to flip this over for four. I don't, I mean, I don't think there's really a way for us to win this game. Increase that. I mean, even if I can get all the, all of something, we're gonna flip that over, draw a card. I'll discard that card to gain three money. Can I at least get the oceans back in order? That's uh, five, 10, 15. To flip this, we'll increase that. We'll draw a card. We'll get a money. Discard that for three money. Yeah, I don't think there's anything else we can do. I got kind of shortchanged here by this, uh, by this situation. I think I was at it eight by this situation over here with the heat. And then that's the game because we can't draw any more crisis cards. So at the end of this turn, we would do it and we lost. So that's we did not successfully terraform keep Mars terraformed. <laughs> so anyway. That's going to be it for today. Thank you guys so much. Let me know if you guys have played Crisis Mode for Terraforming Mars Aries Expedition. I mean, this is a lot of fun because you basically, if you get that expansion, if you have Vista base game and that expansion, you basically have two games um, and you use the same cards for both. So it's very, very different, but it's a lot of fun. And then for player count, there is different um, Crisis cards for player count. So if you play two player, three player, four player, there's a different deck that you use. So anyway, that's going to be it. Thank you guys so much. I'll catch you guys next one. Bye-bye.